Our everyday world feels solid and determined, a place where cause leads to effect. But at the smallest scales, reality behaves like a suggestion rather than a decree. Quantum physics shows us a universe woven from possibilities. When we don't look, particles can be in many states at once, existing as waves of probability. But the simple act of observation can force the universe to choose. Superposition becomes a single outcome. This is not metaphor. It is experiment. The double slit shows interference patterns that vanish when detectors record which path a particle took. Observation changes what is measured. Even stranger is entanglement. Pairs of particles linked so that a change in one mirrors a change in the other across any distance. Einstein called it spooky action at a distance. These phenomena force questions. Do we, the observers, help shape reality? Or are we revealing a deeper informational fabric beneath the surface? Today, the same laws that puzzled early scientists power quantum technologies. Quantum computers exploit superposition and entanglement to solve what classical machines cannot. Quantum sensors promise measurements of impossible precision. The boundary between physics and philosophy blurs. Are we decoding reality or participating in its creation? As Niels Bohr said, what we observe is not nature itself, but nature exposed to our method of questioning. Quantum physics reminds us, observation and reality are intertwined. The quantum revolution is not only technological, it's philosophical. Each experiment reshapes how we define knowledge, certainty, and truth. In the end, quantum physics is not a final answer. It is a continuing conversation between the mind and the universe. Keep asking, keep exploring, because reality itself listens.